bringing up baby has been on my list for quite a while really glad that i finally got around to watching this because i really adored this there are two reasons why i wanted to watch it one the cast two the narrative it sounded really interesting this was released in 1938 directed by howard hawks with a screenplay by hager wilde and dudley nichols the cast we have Catherine hepburn as susan vance and Cary grant as david huxley very much a fan of both of those so that was definitely the initial pull factor and then when i found out that it was about a leopard I got very excited. I am a very big fan of big cats, so that is something that drew me in as well. And to be honest, the narrative is almost farcical. It is a comedy, and it is very funny, and it's it's quite weird to describe. But basically, Susan and David meet in a peculiar circumstance involving the misidentity of a car, and the next thing they know. David turns up at a place where Susan is at a you know a public um, was it a restaurant or a bar a function room that kind of thing and suddenly they end up spending more and more time together due to all of these unfortunate well unfortunate for David circumstances um, for Susan she seems to enjoy his company she's quite fascinated by him David is kind of just annoyed by her presence but then because he is somebody that she is conversing with against David's wishes, she asks for his help when suddenly a leopard turns up at her property and she doesn't know what to do with this leopard or what the point of this leopard is. This leopard is of course called Baby and it's quite a small leopard. It's not a teeny tiny fuzzy cub but it's not a, a giant fully grown leopard either. I'm not sure how old it is but I will say that it's absolutely gorgeous. It is so beautiful and thankfully so well trained. Um, I'll talk more about the leopard in a moment but basically by sheer coincidence Susan takes David to her aunt's house um, and her aunt is actually somebody that David is trying to convince to give him money for a, a project he is working on. There are so many coincidences and so many peculiar situations that arise all due to this one chance encounter they had over the mistaken identity of a car and it's just remarkable how the narrative um, kind of evolves and on the one hand the way I'm describing it maybe it sounds forced like there are so many coincidences and situations that David really wants to get himself out of but never quite manages also he is getting married I think the following day from when this is set and it may sound a bit over the top and a bit unbelievable and on the one hand it kind of is the odds of this happening in the way it is quite unbelievable but at the same time the narrative makes it seem possible and everything weaves together really nicely events that happen don't actually feel that forced and i was really pleased with that because it could have gone either way but i think the narrative is very well written and very well executed baby is adorable baby is precious i don't know well, first of all, I don't know the leopard's real name, but I think there is a, a dog in it. Um, the dog is called Asta, played by George the dog. Very, very cute dog. I don't know how many handlers were on set for Baby. I don't know if they could do a lot of retakes with the leopard or if it was a case of, right, Catherine Hepburn sings to the leopard and steers it into a cage and then they had to kind of leave the leopard alone. I don't know. Or maybe it was raised as a pet and it had a very nice nurturing nature i don't know but in terms of being a performing animal it did very very well i was very impressed they use it um they utilize this this leopard quite a lot it's in a car it's walking it's in all kinds of different situations and i adored it as a big cat fan i just thought it was beautiful obviously you could start a conversation about animal rights and whether or not they should have used this leopard obviously this is the day before cgi and it was not uncommon to use well, not a wild animal, I'm assuming it wasn't a wild leopard, um, but animals that have been raised for this purpose. I adored this film. I really thoroughly liked it. Um, I had a lot of fun with it. Baby is a character I truly loved. Cary Grant and Catherine Hepburn had a brilliant on-screen chemistry, loved both of their performances. I really do I think Catherine Hepburn was absolutely incredible. Um, and Susan, her character, was an absolute delight. I can't pick a favourite scene because there were a lot of them really was a fantastic film if this has been on your radar and you've been meaning to watch it definitely prioritize it i promise you will not be disappointed with bringing up baby